up you guys it's Nita uh, excuse me so today we're watching no escape room this better be good her name is Karen Karen swerve the car hey Karen that'll get her attention you just talk to me for a minute <laughs> I'll talk to you sweetie <laughs> how's school going this is so annoying. It's, it's fine. It'll, it'll be fine. Famous last words. That cell phone, you could have been killed. What are you talking about? What do you mean? What is he talking about? Did you not see the truck? We'll find something else to do. Escape rooms. We've been talking about these things, right? Probably in some creepy guy's garage. Dun dun dun. dun. Roll credits. You don't go to that place. She know. A lot of bad things have happened. If you ever drive up on a small town and the waitress at the dive bar is telling you not to go to this specific area, you don't go to that specific area. We have to go. Nobody has come in since. What, what was that about? That was completely unprovoked. No context clues. Okay, what's wrong with Shadi? Does she be seeing stuff? Like, I'm so confused at what this movie's supposed to be. Cause it's an escape room drama, right? Like, why, why am I getting supernatural vibes now? Sorry. She didn't use no soap. Lady, you work here. See, this is why they put the signs in the restroom. You must wash your hands. Seriously? Looks really popular. <laughs> Dare. Anyone here? Oh, did you hear that door lock? Yeah, y'all in the game now, shoddy. Stay close. Mm -hmm. Ooh. What, you here? what do you want? What the hell? The others are waiting. We haven't much time. She's pretty good. Uh, don't drink anything she gives you. See? You're like, uh-uh, nope. Did y'all even pay to get in here? In case anything could happen to you. This is crazy because it's like, if you want to take the creep factor down just a little bit, this is really how escape rooms are. Like you literally sign your life away just in case something happens while you're in there. Like a theme park ride or whatever, you sign on a liability form. But they don't usually offer you smoking chai tea. That's weird. Oh, okay. All right. I was going to say this is kind of bright for a scary movie, but can't see anything. Customary. This is what we're used to. I don't get why scary movies need to be so dark all the time. Like, I'm literally trying to see what's going on. The town sent five people and were never heard from again. Ooh, and it's five of them. Are they being hypnotized? They're really into this. Okay, that was weird. <laughs> yeah. This is, uh, this is cool, huh? <laughs> let me get let me just ease up in here <laughs> oh dude look kind of disrespectful because she definitely looks 12 and he definitely looks 30. yeah she she's too young for you bro is he finna die don't put that on Ew. Whoa. what did he see Okay, I'm not, I'm not saying, am I blind? No, no, I'm fine. Did nobody else see that? See what? He's gonna die first. Oh, I didn't do the kill order. Tyler, Melanie, the 30 year old, the dad, and then the daughter. Oh, well, the daughter's gonna live because of course. Ew, numbers. Numbers, that's how much. That's what I said. Mm. He might be a plant for real. Ooh, masks, so scary. Another room, thought it was escape room, not rooms. Mm. Tyler, hello? It sounds like I'm first. Her. I don't know what it means. Mm. It means that you're second. No, I mean, what is it? It's asking for you. No. <laughs> Tyler's not into it. Prediction. So the five people that they're trying to save is them from the past because this is a time loop. I wanna, I wanna leave. I'm done. You I'm done. <laughs> you guys listening? What's the, what's the, uh... It's oh, awake. Oh, awake! Awake! Ty! Ty! Okay, so did they really let him out? Yeah, do you know something you're not telling us? I know all the secrets of this house. And they're on the payroll. He's not joking. Come on, That's the funny thing. He's not joking. Are we playing or aren't we? No, y'all not playing. It's not a joke. It's wet. I got scared. The inventor is here. 
the 30 year old he's the inventor the safe word did they just ignore it are we trapped in here tyler, tyler did get out did he though do they think it's real now or are they still just kind of like mm, iffy what do you see Karen! <laughs> Karen! oh goodness kind of creepy <laughs> Dude, ah! How was, that still standing? was that dub did he voice over that part he has to find her because how does he tell her mother that he lost her in an escape room hello it's not just a game you're not safe you're meant to be Josie? this is the clearest indistinct whispering i've heard in a while mm. I'm seeing a lot of things that look distinctly like human body parts. Mm. Hey, yo, Karen, can you try to find a door or something? She's just standing there. Get out. Fight for your life. Not you closing doors. You're supposed to be walking, trying to find your way out. Is she climbing in there with a dead body? Did him waving his hand over the light open the door? What do we need keys for? He reminds me of someone and I can't place the guy. I'm not even getting a plot. I just see his face. It's giving boring. <laughs> Lights flickering and rapid breathing. Very scary. Low growling from something that we haven't seen. So scary. Such fear. Brother. Did you eat? Yeah. Did you cook for me? Did, I? Did you? No. Oh. Can you make any of that out? So there's a lake, there's a hand. Show me, let me figure it out. This tra this fade to black transition that they do is giving me like TV show vibes. I uh, sub this physics teacher at the school that I work at. Physics, a likely story. Nobody studies physics. Melanie, let's go. Oh, she's stuck. There was no rule saying that they needed to stay together, but it's like the house is punishing Melanie for not staying with the guys. Like, you see a video of yourself, you're gonna stop and look. There were no rules here. <gasps> Don't answer it. You have to, what else can you do? She's been in this um, wall in the box for like, four or five scenes now. I'm bored. Movie, you're boring me. It's nothing but a sick, twisted game. None of this stuff is real. Karen. Is it not? Ty, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. It's not, it's not me, Ty, it's not me. You're into the time slip. <laughs> oh. I keep Whoa. seeing a lake. So what's gonna happen with the lake? Not you hearing birds. The birds are chirping. <laughs> what do they have somebody behind the picture? Just, oh wow. Truman Show. Pretty tree. Very aesthetically pleasing. How, what am I supposed to be feeling right now? Oh, that's creepy. Who is that? Hey, should I be watching this? Seems very intimate. Is also very slow and drawn out. That's the issue I'm having with some of these scenes. What is this? What is this fade to black cutaway bullshit? So impactful. Are you walking back towards the painting? That just are you? You want to go again? He wants to go again. Can y'all not find like a, another? All those tools, just pick something up and try to fish it out with. Don't touch, don't touch the poop. Don't. Literally, uh, there are tools in the whole cabinets full of stuff. Just pick something up and... Yeah, I'm just gonna... Yeah, he's just gonna, okay. So fishing it out with something else wasn't even an option. I'm disgusted. This isn't fun. This movie isn't fun. Not them digging in a toilet making me hungry. So Tyler's dead, M Michelle, she's dead, Andrew's dead, the dad's marked, so he's gonna die. 
unless they both make it out alive. I haven't played Hangman in a while. Melanie. Melanie. What did I call her? Okay. Mm, they're back together. Does that mean the movie's about to be over? Just don't leave me dead. You left him. We are not gonna die. We're gonna get out of here, okay? I'm gonna do Famous everything. last words. What if that's what this whole place is? A time loop. An echo. Dad. It's in her stomach. In stomach. Dad, what are you doing? You know what he's doing. You just told him what to do. Oh god. Okay, you're overselling it. Is that the master key? Are they back at the diner? Mmm, because she did hear something at the diner. Okay, so what happens if they just jump out right now and be like, Ayo, don't go to the um, escape room. Why are they afraid of her? It's just her. Literally just tell her, don't go to the escape room. They did not need that. So is it over? Like, did they? They're stuck. They didn't get out. No. Okay, but they have the master key. So shouldn't the master key have worked on the car as well? So Andrew wasn't a part of it and he didn't come back in the end like I thought he would, which would have made it better. That would have made it more interesting. I think Andrew coming back as the inventor. Who was the person in the um in the morgue box with her? Who was that? We didn't get any any clarification on that. Apparently there were five people that were lost there, but Josie also seems like she was lost there, so six. They had this whole thing with the dad being dragged into the lake and they just did nothing with it. What? It, it could have been like at the end, Karen and the dad are about to leave, but then they realize that the dad can't get out because he still has the chains on him. That, that would have been fun. Karen was just annoying most of this movie. That thing with Melanie was still really unfair. Why does every movie have a character named Melanie? I feel like at that part where they saw Tyler the second time, I feel like he should have been able to see them and then he gets snatched up. That would have been better. It's just a lot of points into, oh, some of the scenes were really long. Like that scene where she was like in the box, in the wall, in the morgue, that, they left that play for a while. That was a really long time and it could have been like 10 seconds max. We didn't need to keep cutting to her. And the cut scene, like the fade to black, that was not needed. This is a movie, not a TV show. I could see the setup for a second movie here. Let me direct it though, because y'all don't know what y'all doing. So that was no escape room. I didn't like it. It could have been much better. It could have been done better to deliver a more scary experience. But this was a like PG-13 or like TV-14 movie. So I guess you can't really do too much. Four out of 10. I wouldn't watch it again. If they made a sequel, I'd watch it just to see if the sequel was better. Well, that's it for this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.